So there's a new study out on ketone supplements that I want to bring your attention and help you make sense of it. So let's look at the title. A novel formulation of the ketone ester rapidly increases circulating beta-hydroxybutyrate concentrations in healthy adults. So the ketone ester they're talking about is one that which I probably can't pronounce, but I'm going to throw it up on the screen so you can take a look at it for yourself. Bis-hexanol R13-butanediol. Let me know in the comments if I pronounced that correctly. So what's the study look like? Essentially, it's 15 healthy adults. These people have no health problems, and they're given either 12 and a half grams or 25 grams of the ketone ester powder drink after a meal. And they compare it to a control substance, which shouldn't do anything. They measure their ketone levels in the blood and the blood sugar levels for up to two hours after they took the ketone supplement. And they find that the ketone levels in the blood are significantly higher within 15 minutes after consuming the ketone supplement. And the ketone levels in the blood also stayed elevated for up to two hours during the measurement period. As for blood sugar, however, there were no changes in blood sugar levels. The ketone drink did not raise or lower blood sugar levels. No side effects were reported other than burping and flushing in one or two people. Most of these were determined to be mild and they went away within a couple hours at, at the most. So this investigation adds to the evidence that ketone supplements do in fact raise ketone levels in the blood, beta-hydroxybutyrate levels in the blood. Because the study only lasted two hours, there was no weight loss measured here. Now, if you're taking ketone supplements in the hopes that it's going to duplicate the effects of a ketogenic diet and lead to significant weight loss, well, the research so far doesn't appear to show this. As I revealed in a previous video, the research on ketogenic supplements and weight loss is not very encouraging, and I'll link to my video on this below this one so you can check it out for yourself and see the actual studies and the results. So that's it for this study. Until next time, I'm Joe from SupplementClarity.com. Take care.